let's get into what is Wagyu beef, right? Let's break it down a little bit. So if you looked it up, you would definitely see that it, you know, Wa is Japanese and Gyu is cow or cattle. So it really just means Japanese cattle. That's in the, in the purest form, it's cow from Japan, right? But it's really like a super marble, genetically superior cattle from Japan, basically, to kind of break it down, I guess. Totally. Would you agree? Yeah. I mean, I mean, as far as eating goes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we don't have farm animals, right? Yeah, so. Right? Well, it's funny you said because originally they were actually, you know, farm animals. According to the, you know, American Wagyu Association, where I'm pulling some of this information, right? They were used in agriculture, and they're selected for their physical endurance because they have so much of that intermuscular fat, right? That marbling, and that's what, like, makes it so luscious and so tender and so amazing, right? So they had that, you know, they provided a really nice, quick, you know, available energy source, right, right? while they were farming. And it's funny because I, I was reading this other book called America's Wagyu Trail, and this guy compares it to saying, like, like using these cows in agriculture is kind of like the French using foie gras to grease their wagon wheels. Like, kind of the same, right? But, I mean, they are, they do have energy sources, right? I mean, they did it out of offer. necessity, yeah, right? That's a good one. Yeah. Greasing the wagon wheels with foie gras. They but used it's, what they had. It's, yeah, right? It, it, exactly. It's what they had. So, one key aspect of the genetics that's present and you know um it's this particular gene called the scd gene i'm not even going to try to freaking say it because it's like biological yeah we're going to keep it we're going to keep it nice and light but it basically is present in higher levels in wagyu cattle than in other breeds so basically this results in the higher proportion of unsaturated fatty acids which contributes to the distinctive taste and flavor right so that's one of the things in addition to the scd gene um a couple other genes or this one gene that it's known it's called the myosatin gene, which is involved in regulating muscle growth. So variations uh, in this gene have been linked to difference, differences in muscle mass and marbling in Wagyu cattle. So it's got a couple of different genes. So like, the, we're, like we're saying, it's genetically a little bit different than other cattle, right? Yep. Sure, and the, 